Welcome to the Tradex Foods 3-Minute Market Insight. This is Robert Ryerson, and here's the seafood news for the week of March 27, 2017. It's not shaping up to be a very good year for Vietnamese soy producers, as harsh weather and increased import tariffs strengthen finished goods. Pangaceous pricing and demand is strong in the domestic Chinese market, primarily due to the short supply in Vietnam. Heavier than normal rainfall and colder weather has caused production to drop 30 to 40 percent from last year at this time. Since last summer, Vietnamese farmers have experienced high mortalities of the young fish fry. Up to 35 percent of their livestock have been dying since July. The Pangaceous market has been growing steadily for a few years in China, mostly to supermarkets and restaurants. The most popular item is butterfly pangaceous. One of the biggest suppliers in Vietnam recently sold out of this item in two weeks, even with prices up 20% on a 20 kg case. In North America, Vietnamese soy imports could be suspended as of September 1st after federal regulations and inspection will transition from FDA to USDA. One Vietnamese processor we spoke to would face a 69 cent tariff for imports of raw frozen unbreaded fillets, which would bring West Coast prices from $1.52 to $2.22 a pound, placing finished goods well out of the market. Vendors who do not get USDA approval could suspend exports to the USA, focusing instead on domestic business or Canada. Swai was heavily discussed at Seafood Expo North America last week in Boston, as many believe domestic catfish production could replace imported swai products. However, at a price tag of $4.55 for 3 to 5 ounce fillets from the southern USA, imported swai will remain below a domestic catfish, even with the new tariffs. We have seen substitute demand strengthen for Pollock fillets as an inexpensive whitefish alternative particularly on smaller fillet sizes. East Coast prices for Pollock are between $1.23 and $1.25 per pound on 2-4 to four ounce IQF Pollock fillets, an attractive price as SWI pricing could rise a further $0.10 cents to between $1.70 and $1.75 by mid-April. Stay tuned for another update on the SWI market in the coming weeks. To wrap this episode up, our Tradex Live offer of the week is for Sinbad brand Swy Fillets. We have all sizes available in Boston at $1.60 a pound US. Click or tap the icon above to view this offer. Thank you for joining me for the Tradex Foods 3 Minute Market Insight. This is Robert Ryerson. Buy smart and eat more seafood.